Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and delete your predictive text messages and stuff like that. So, let's go over here, the search bar. So, I'm also going to show some extra things. For example, once you like uh, go on your text message like this and you get like some weird messages on the top, how you can basically delete that. Really simple guys, let's go for to our settings so go over to your settings and then you want to go over to system so once you're in here you want to go down to reset options on system software once you're in here cl click on clear learning dictionary so terms that were automatically added as you entered then will be deleted just click on clear so now what will actually happen is that all of your text messages and stuff like that that you typed in won't get automatically recommended to you. So that's how simple it actually is guys to do it. But I'm also going to show some extra stuff like for example this. So let's just go ahead and change our language. Actually guys, once you change your language, you can also get a other type of keyboard. So if you want like a Japanese keyboard, you can basically go on here. So I don't really specifically know which one is uh, Japanese or Chinese, but let's just say that this one is. Let's click on that. Now, what you want to do is you want to go over here. Okay, I cannot really understand this, but what you want to do is you just want to go here and then you want to go over to your own language again. So once we do that, guys, you can actually see our keyboards on here. So I did it a lot of times if you see like a lot of languages on here just to test it out. But let's just say that you just did that and now you want a keyboard. You just want to switch over to the keyboard that you want and the language that you actually change it to. So let's just say uh, Japanese. So what you can basically do is you can go over to here, add or edit terms. And also guys, this is also a thing. You can also delete or turn off your predictive text like you see on here. So once you turn it on on here, you can also turn it off on here. So that's pretty cool like you see guys. And that's how you can also turn it off. But let's just do this one. So let's just say that we want to add this as our keyboard. Just click on add term. <clears throat> okay, once you do that guys, like you see, you have a Japanese keyboard. And now let's go back. And how do you use it? Really simple guys, once you go to text, you already have that, but what you also can do is you can change it. Go over to these three dots over here, and now you can change the language of your keyboard. That's pretty cool. So I can just change it to whatever that I want, and I can also turn off my predicted task, uh, text. So I hope you enjoyed the video guys, if you did, just go ahead and like and subscribe that will actually support me so I can help a lot more people out with my videos. Thank you so much guys. You can also just follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Link in the description. Also guys, add me on the PS5. Really simple. My name is just Kiri and take care.